Title, Internet Rangers, From Pixels to Heroes Mike Horatio is infamous for creating some of the worst TV shows and movies anyone's ever seen. His ideas are often bizarre, poorly executed, and riddled with cringeworthy humor. Despite being widely mocked, Mike continues making content, convinced he's a creative genius. One day, while recovering from his latest flop, Detective Hamster, Mike has a dream about an internet world populated by digital beings. Inspired, he jots down a pitch for a new show called Internet Rangers. Surprisingly, a desperate network greenlights the show, helping to fill a gap in their late-night anime block. Mike assembles a team of animators and voice actors, but due to his lack of interest in actual production, the crew secretly pour their passion into making Internet Rangers genuinely incredible. The show within the story, Internet Rangers follows four anthro-animal heroes as they battle prejudice in the digital world. Each character brings something unique to the team. Rain Nebula, Cyber Hyena, Leader, a cool and collected hyena with white hair, a tail that gleams like starlight, and sharp shades. Ray is calm under pressure, charismatic, and always prioritizes his team. Flynn Ermanova, Nano Stout, Brain, a quirky genius with goggles. Flynn has a mind for tech and a knack for inventing gadgets that turn the tide in their missions. Despite his intelligence, he's humble and fiercely loyal. Lyra Cherubhart, Angel Ferret, Heart, a kind and brave transgender ferret with soft, pastel-colored fur. Lyra stands up for those who can't defend themselves and serves as the moral compass of the group. Kirona Vortex, Void Raccoon, Muscle, a dark and brooding raccoon who always claims to be edgy, but melts at the sight of kittens or emotional moments. He's the team's powerhouse and their biggest softy. The team stumbles upon the influence zone, a part of the internet where coded propaganda promotes the idea that furries and other anthro beings are subhuman. Realizing how this toxic ideology impacts both digital and real worlds, they make it their mission to dismantle the system, pixel by pixel. The show mixes heartfelt moments with action-packed sequences and thought-provoking commentary on acceptance and individuality. The real-world impact, against all odds. Internet Rangers becomes a smash hit. Fans adore the characters, relate to their struggles, and celebrate the themes of inclusivity and acceptance. Social media is flooded with fan art, cosplay, and essays about how the show changed lives. Unbeknownst to Mike, the writers and animators receive widespread acclaim for making a masterpiece under his clueless direction. The ending, Mike, basking in his newfound fame is invited to speak at a convention. When asked about the deeper meaning of Internet Rangers, he panics, not understanding why people love the show. To salvage his image, he hires genetic scientists to create real-life versions of the Internet Rangers. The team emerges exactly as they appear in the show, with fully developed personalities. Ray handles stressful party logistics. Flint impresses kids with tech magic tricks. Lyra comforts shy birthday children. Kironai, unsuccessfully, tries to stay stoic but ends up leading the conga line. The Internet Rangers become beloved figures, bringing joy to children and continuing the show's legacy of promoting kindness, acceptance, and individuality. Mike, still clueless about his accidental success, declares he's working on a sequel. But everyone secretly knows the Internet Rangers are better off handling things themselves. Tagline, from the screen to the real world, heroes come in all shapes, sizes, and fur patterns.